Hey there, everybody. Welcome to Amazing Indiana. My name is Fred, and it's great to have you on the channel today. Please remember to subscribe to Amazing Indiana, and also remember to like this video. Well, today we are back at the Indiana Dunes National Lakeshore area on the south shore of Lake Michigan in northern Indiana, and we are going to be exploring the area known as West Beach. West Beach has a wonderful boardwalk which will take us up and over some very large sand dunes. And I'll tell you what, we're going to be very happy that we've got this boardwalk. So let's see this part of amazing Indiana. This is one of the most cool parts of the uh, National Seashore here at uh, Indiana Dunes. This is this amazing uh, set of stairs. Um, it's all part of a boardwalk system, which goes up over these dunes. Uh, it takes you up on a lovely hike. We're gonna do that. Um, this takes you up into the area where a woman by the name of Diana, uh, and she's now known as Diana of the Dunes, uh, lived, um, I think, about 100 years ago. And she was instrumental, I think, in uh, raising the awareness of a lot of people about just what a great resource uh, these dunes are. And you can see people hiking up the uh, steps right now. So I think I better get to that. So, you know what? I think I'm going to be absolutely fascinated at the end of the day to see how many steps I got on uh, Fitbit, uh, actually how many flights of stairs, because I think I am going to really uh, knock some uh, steps off today. All right. Onward and upward we go. The only way that many people would be able to get over any of these dunes is to go over um, the stairway and boardwalk. So it really is a great benefit. And as you climb, you really do get a sense of the immensity of these dunes. We keep moving up steps and we're not even at the top yet. When we get to the top, we should, uh, if I recall correctly, get a pretty good view of, of Lake Michigan. But you can see these steps just go up and up and up. Okay, we're not all the way up yet, but we are getting one of our first views of Lake Michigan. And in the far distance, you might be able to make out Chicago. Um, you can also see the West Beach uh, bathhouse. Um, you can take a shower there. You can, I think, get goodies, uh, some snacks. And as we pan up and around, you're gonna see we've still got some steps to go. So having hiked um, up that those stairs in the blazing sun. This is wonderful because now what you get as you uh, come over the top of the dunes is you get this wonderful uh, boardwalk uh, that descends into this wonderful forest here. And it's nice and cool. There's a nice gentle breeze uh, blowing through the trees. Absolutely, uh, absolutely gorgeous. And as I said, kind of a nice, uh, nice change after hiking all of those steps up to the top of the dune and that first view place. So what I really wish I had done was kept account of how many steps uh, I ascended to get up to the top, but I'm sure I can probably find that somewhere or you can if you um, if you go online. And as I walk down through here, you catch glimpses of uh, of Lake Michigan off in the distance through the trees. Just really, really pretty. Um, great place to be on a, you know, it's not a really hot day today, kind of a mild August day. Okay, we're approaching a little part of the trail here, which appears to be leveling out. As I said, I have been here 
uh, at various times of the year. And the last time I was here was in February or March, and all of the trees were bare, so it had an entirely different look to it. Uh, today, everything is wonderfully, wonderfully wooded, and this boardwalk is just great for getting you right out here in the midst of all of this. Okay, so we are gonna get to climb yet another set of stairs here. And up we go once again. Ah! Out into the bright blazing sun. You can see all the sand around here. And up we go. So we went up, we went down, and now we're going up yet again. And it looks like we go up for a little bit more after we get to this flat spot. And here we get yet some more beautiful views of, of Lake Michigan. Wind is blowing a little bit out there today, so there are some white caps out on the water. And as we move along, you can see the bathhouse off in the distance. So again, we start going down these stairs on this uh, boardwalk system, and we're descending now uh, between, between the dunes, and you'll see also that the uh, trees change as we get closer to uh, Lake Michigan. Different kind of, different kind of forest, still awfully pretty. And when we get down to the next view site, I'm just gonna give you guys a, a view of all of the sand around here. It's nuts. One would think you were at the ocean. You would not realize that you are at one of the, one of the great lakes. And here's another sign about Diana of the Dunes. And again, she lived out here from 1915 to 1925. And you can just take a look out that way and see how beautiful it is. And you'll also see how the um, boardwalk is gonna descend further. And as I move the camera down there a little bit, you can see where the uh, boardwalk is going to move through those woods. And just for a bit of perspective, this is where we um, where we came down. Um, the top of those trees over there is the top of the dune that we were that we were on. And now we're going to be moving down this way. So one of the things that you can see as we move along this boardwalk trail um, is that we are actually moving right now through an area that. Um, uh, is a wetlands or a temporary wetlands from time to time. Uh, I have been back out here when uh, there's been more moisture in the ground um, and sometimes you'll see various birds uh, back down in here but you'll see that we're right now as we move along the boardwalk here we are uh, continuing to move to the uh, shore of Lake Michigan and we're again out in the exposed sun, so looking forward to getting back in the woods. Okay, we came off the boardwalk, and this is where the walking gets a little hard, because as I pan around to show the trail we just came off of, um, we end up in we end up in sand. So it can be a little tiring, uh, but if you just take it slow and steady, you're gonna be okay. Again, just more of the sand that we're gonna be uh, that we're walking through to get to the uh, bathhouse is the next major goal in this hike and it's there that you can get your special sticker for having uh, hiked Diana of the Dunes' trail. I can't wait. This is the uh, West Beach area of the National Park and um, Pretty nice beach. It's pretty narrow though, as you can see. The dunes come right down to the shore, uh, so it's a little narrower than the beach over at the um, at the state park. But it's still quite nice. That's the end of the Diana of the Dunes hike at 
the West Beach section of the Indiana Dunes National Lakeshore. And as promised, here's the sticker that you can get for having hiked this particular trail. I made a mistake when I was hiking and I said that you uh, pick it up at the bathhouse. That's not true. You need to take a picture at the bathhouse and you need to take some pictures along uh, the trail and then you go back to the visitor center uh, that the National Park Service runs on um, Highway 49 and you can um, show the rangers your pictures and they will give you this nifty sticker. So. I think it was worth it. Uh, it's something that I'm um, kind of proud of, I guess, because I hiked all that way. Uh, and kind of nice to have in my collection of other hiking memorabilia. Anyhow, hope that you enjoyed uh, getting a taste of this part of the Indiana Dunes area on Amazing Indiana. And I'll have some more videos about the Indiana Dunes uh, area in future episodes. Thanks for tuning in today, and please remember to subscribe to the channel, and also please like this video. And I'll see you again on another episode of Amazing Indiana.